Julia Sim is a machine learning accelerated modeling and simulation platform built by Julia Computing. It integrates with the best tools of the Julia open source ecosystem, including packages like modeling toolkit and differential equations, and extends them to give all of the necessary components for industrial scale problems. You can learn more about these open source tools from the Simulating Big Models with Modeling Toolkit workshop that we just ran at this JuliaCon. The recording is available on YouTube. Here, I am showing the circuits module from the JuliaSim standard library to accelerate the workflows that we demonstrated in the workshop. I pulled in the necessary components from the standard library and used the connect statements to generate the composed model. The simulation is then ran on the Julia Hub Cloud Compute Platform in a way that can automatically scale depending on your compute needs. This entire system is an interactive modeling framework, and so you can easily check things like what your current equations are and use the simplification techniques and more easily debug what you're working on. Julia Sim comes with a lot of proprietary model libraries, so here now I'm showing the HVAC.jl library, which includes components for high-performance simulation of air conditioning models. We can create customized libraries for new user engagements. If you're interested, please contact our sales team and we can discuss the terms and go forward with that. What sets Julia Sim apart, though, other than its base speed, you know, already being faster than other competitors in this area, is its ability to automatically integrate machine learning into these simulation workflows and accelerate them a whole other order of magnitude. Here I'm showing the circuitization GUI where we can upload FMUs generated from tools like Modelica and then specify the space over which we want to build the machine learning surrogate. Here, we're going to use the continuous time echo state network, and I'm just tweaking a few parameters. And then what this will do is it'll generate an approximate model by sampling the simulation of the FMU and generate a diagnostic report of its accuracy. We've already shown that these machine learning surrogates can accelerate your simulation speeds by around 10x to 100x over leading Modelica compilers. Julia Sim has many other new tools currently in development. So here I'm showing a graphical user interface of the upcoming Pumas QSB environment powered by Julia Sim. It allows for quickly building graphical representations of chemical reaction networks, which can then be directly simulated through the Catalyst and Modeling Toolkit.jl tools. This will soon be integrated directly into VS Code environment in a reactive form so that it automatically generates Julia files that you can interact with, you know, and, you know, click in the GUI, click in the Julia code, go back and forth, similar to a workflow like Pluto.jl. GUIs for other domains like acausal modeling are coming in the near future. Thank you for watching, and if you're interested in any of these tools, please get in touch. If you're interested in any custom developments that are in this area of modeling and simulation, please get in touch. Julia Sim is still young and can definitely be molded to the needs of our customers. Thank you very much.